Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Mike with Wu Audio. This week's episode of Frequently Asked Questions, we're going to talk briefly about can tube amplifiers drive planar magnetic headphones? We think there are some misinformation or outdated information on the internet around this topic, and we hope this short video will help clear up some confusion. When we hear people say tube amps cannot drive planar magnetic headphones, we think they may be referring to an OTL-designed tube amplifier. Now, to be clear, an OTL amplifier can drive planar magnetic headphones, but it's just not the ideal pairing because OTL amplifiers prefer a high impedance load, while most planar magnetic headphones are a low impedance load. With the exception of our WA2, which is an OTL amplifier, all of our amplifiers can drive planar magnetic headphones to their full performance potential. In our previous video, episode 17 and episode 18, we talked briefly about output transformerless versus transformer coupled. And we also discussed headphone sensitivity versus impedance. If you haven't watched those videos yet, I'll put a link in the description. As an example that our tube amplifiers can drive planar magnetic headphones to their full performance potential, the Abyss 1266 TC is regarded around the world as one of the highest performance planar magnetic headphones on the market. And the guys at Abyss has publicly recommended our flagship WA33 amplifier to pair with their flagship headphone. And they made a short video reviewing WA33 paired with the 1266TC. I'll put a link in the description so you can watch that video. In previous years at trade shows, we paired the Odyssey LCD-X headphones with our WA7 Fireflies. We also paired Meze Audio's flagship headphone, the Imperium, with our WA8 Eclipse battery-operated tube amplifier. And also Hi-Fi Man's best planar magnetic headphone, the Susfara, with our amplifiers at trade shows. These are just a few examples that our amplifiers can drive planar magnetic headphones to their full performance potential. We hope this short video helped clarify the misconception that tube amplifiers cannot drive planar magnetic headphones. If you have a question about your Wu Audio system, send us an email and we'll try our best to answer them. And if you have a topic that you'd like us to cover in an upcoming FAQ video, send us an email with the subject line FAQ videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see everyone in our next video.